Item number SCP-953 Object Class Keter Special Containment Procedures SCP-953 is to be kept in a Type 4 containment cell at the end of Hallway 99 and Site 17. Subject is to be provided the following. 1 half kilograms of fresh liver daily for consumption. Clean drinking water in plentiful quantities. Clean bedding, futon, and blankets to be exchanged by the subject and laundered weekly. Small luxury items, plum wine, reading materials, etc., may be provided for as an occasional reward for good behavior as part of psychological conditioning. Direct human contact with 953 is strictly forbidden due to 953's mind-altering properties. For this reason, all personnel must respect a 100-meter safe zone when the hermetically sealed door is opened. Delivery of food and other items will be carried out by an automatic robotic assistant. Should containment fail, 953 can be theoretically terminated by gunfire. However, due to its nature, recognizing 953 may be difficult. Because of the inadequacy of purely physical containment procedures to control 953, psychological attainment is also necessary. For this reason, the approach to 953's containment chamber is to be lined with open cage dog kennels, preferably of the Korean Jindo or American Fox Hound breed. 953 displays an extreme phobia of domesticated canines and will not pass within 10 meters of one especially when canines are barking or alerted. 953 is to be considered hostile to human life, dangerous, and armed at all times. Any transport must be done by the supervision of at least six armed personnel. Its preferred killing method is a barehanded strike to the abdomen, penetrating the abdominal cavity and removing the liver, which it will later consume. If given time, however, it will choose to linger over its kill, torturing its victim as it seems to enjoy the infliction of pain upon another sentient being. 953 is a female red fox, 8 kilograms in weight, with a spine that splits around the 26th vertebrae into 9 separate tails. Subject displays polymorphic properties, however, allowing it to take the form of various other objects and beings, most commonly an attractive Korean female. Subject will display some bulbine aspect. Ears, tails, paws, eyes, fur, voice, mannerisms, and all of its alternate forms. This can serve to identify the subject should it attempt to disguise, although 953 will attempt to conceal its tails through clothing and other methods. In addition to polymorphic abilities, 953 displays moderate-level psionic abilities, namely suggestion and telepathy. Although insufficient to fool an outside observer, an entranced subject can be convinced of a variety of false facts, including the nature of 953, its own nature, and the nature of things around it. 953 has used this in the past to, among other things, deceive police officers investigating reports of loud screams from a hotel room, convince a mother to roast and eat her own child, carry out acts of necrophilia upon Agent Ramsey's fiancé in full view of said agent, and succeed in systematic murder of 27 attendees of Yifkan blank. Addendum 1. Prior History 953 has been encountered by the SCP Foundation and its predecessors numerous times, with the first encounter having been taken place in Busan, Korea, shortly after the Second World War. To date, 953 has escaped and been recovered six times, resulting in the deaths of blank SCP agents during various incidents. After its latest escape, 953 was not heard from for over blank years, still suddenly resurfacing in Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania on June blank at Yifkan blank, which it had been attending in the guise of a furry enthusiast. Before being captured, 953 carried out over two dozen murders of convention staff and attendees more than during any other single incident to date. The mutilated bodies were found in various places throughout the hotel including inside a mattress, hanging from a shower curtain, and served as the main course at a 
hotel banquet. Surviving attendees were administered Class A amnestics and released from Foundation custody. Foundation personnel assigned to capture 9 by 3 after this latest incident noted that the subject appeared listless and apathetic and did not resist capture. No further casualties have been resulted from 9 by 3 from the date. Addendum 2 Special Emergency Order as misidentification of her species tends to violently agitate 9 by 3 all personnel are to be hereby ordered to refer to her as a kumiho and not a kutsune. Personnel asking what the difference is are to be reminded of the difference between a Cherokee Indian and a New Delhi Indian. O5 blank. Addendum 3. Personal Staffing Revision Following the unfortunate and completely preventable death of Agent Gallagher, any personnel found to have current or prior ties to the furry or otaku community are to be immediately reassigned to other projects. O5 blank. Addendum 4. Folkloric Control Procedures As a reminder, Staff assigned to 9 by 3 are to follow all instructions for interacting with the subject, no matter how odd or arbitrary they may seem. Keep in mind that the people of Asia interacted with these beings for centuries before we came into the scene. What we think of as fairy tales were their version of special containment procedures. O5 blank. 